Hey everybody, Crypto Mentor 99 How you doing? I have no idea why I'm doing this video <laughs> other than the fact that I'm doing this video. So in between videos, I'm just reminiscing and this random thought came into my head. When I was a little boy growing up in Illinois and my dad took me to a professional wrestling match. Now I'm 61, so professional wrestling looked way different back then than it does today. And it was more localized markets than it was like a WWE and yeah, World Wrestling or the WWF World Wrestling Federation, Hulk Hogan. Back in the day, they were they had just a different build and physique and stuff like that. But my famous wrestler, I can't believe I'm doing this video, was Pepper Gomez. In the description box below, there's a link. Go to the three minute mark. That is Pepper Gomez as of like three or four years ago. He's changed a lot, let me tell you. But I got to tell you this story. So I used to watch professional wrestling in Illinois as a little boy, and I used to think it was real. And for those professional wrestling fans out there, you could get pretty worked up. And I was like, you know, third, fourth, fifth grade, and they're beating on each other. And I would say to my dad, dad, look at this. And he would say, well, you know, Crypto Matter 99, um, that, that's not real. Oh, no, Dad, you're wrong. Look, look. I would get so worked up. So where we lived, they had, there was a um, wrestling promoter. I don't know if this was his real name, but he used to be on TVs and sell used cars. I'm serious. His name was Bob Luce, like L-U-C-E maybe. And his wife was a professional wrestler. Well, Bob Luce would get on and talk about used cars and like the next matches coming up for the next week. Well, then he started this one special where you could come down to the steakhouse before the match, meet a wrestler or two, and then get like really good tickets. So I said to my dad, Dad, what I want for my birthday, and I'm kind of thinking about this because my birthday is coming up in January. I said, Dad, I would love to see a wrestling match in person and go to the Bob Lou State Dinner before the match and meet a wrestler. My dad's like, okay. So lo and behold, for this little guy's birthday, we get two tickets to the steak dinner, to meet a wrestler, to then go into the match, good seats, and see the wrestlers. So we did that. And my dad and I were sitting, there was probably in the room, I'm going to say 40 people. It was a long time ago, maybe 30, you know what I mean? And, you know, we're eating our steak dinner and baked potato and, in walks Pepper Gomez, and I, you could, even as a little guy, my heart was just popping out of my chest. There was Pepper Gomez, and he would go to the table, each table, sign autographs, and you would have thought, I mean, Pepper Gomez, I met Pepper Gomez. Anyhow, if you've watched a video this long, you know I like professional wrestling. So, met Pepper Gomez, and then we go into the match, right? And they're pretty good seats. I, I, I often wondered how much my dad spent on, like, the steak dinner, meet the wrestler, and then have some pretty good seats. And even as a little guy... The closer I got, I'm like, Dad, you may be on to something. Maybe this is fake. 
Well, then I remember Pepper, Pepper Gomez, he wrestled and he was getting, yeah, he was getting beat up and he was in the corner and he got cut. And I was like, dad, Pepper got cut. Pepper got cut. My dad didn't probably have the, the guts to tell me, well, he just took a razor blade and just kind of nicked himself, you know. But uh, anyhow, I don't know why I was thinking about Pepper going, oh, yeah, well, my birthday's coming up. And I was thinking about my dad who's been gone since August year 2000. So that's been going, you know, nine, nine, 19 years. Anyhow, Pepper Gomez, I salute you. Look in the video. Um, go to the three-minute mark. He lo Pepper looks a lot different today than he did, you know, many years ago at – as we all, right? As we all age. Anyhow, Crypto Mentor 99, if I haven't already done this, Pepper Gomez, I salute you. I know you were in the Navy. Thank you for making my day that one cold February day in 1960 something. This little guy never forgot. Anyhow, love y'all. See you later. Bye bye.